Hi and hello! Welcome to my channel. My name is Janae and today I'll be attempting a TikTok trend where you take glass and paint it to look like ceramic. Um, you paint it with acrylic but you also mix in some baking powder but also I saw baking soda so I'm gonna attempt the powder first and if that doesn't work then I'll switch to soda. So I got some glass things from Dollar Tree. I got this vase and it's more of a test piece because what I really want to do with these is make some planters for my many plants I have just for some smaller succulents and so I got a vase for a test I got a couple glasses that I thought were cool these are slightly different slightly so I got those and then in the crafting section I found the square square piece that I really like and I'm very excited for this one and then this is an old candle jar I have just laying around so I'm gonna attempt it with this one too okay so I'm gonna start with this vase as a test piece so we're gonna try with the baking powder and I think I want to make it in this red but I want to make it a bit deeper so I got some other like, I got black, I got white, I got raw umber, the stuff from my painting class, and I'm gonna try to darken it up a little bit. Okay, so I'm gonna tangle it, and then I'm gonna try and darken it with this. I'm gonna put some powder in here. I don't know how much to put in. Okay. I may have just put too much. Oh no. I keep adding too much of one thing. Here's what my paint looks like. Looks very weird. Ooh. Oh my god. The texture of the paint is really freaking weird. Oh my goodness. It's like, it kind of sounds like bubbly, does that make sense? Oh my goodness. It's like, <clears throat> the soda is like kind of reacting with the paint to make it bubbly like I thought it was just like gonna be the texture of the soda is gonna make it but it's like actually kind of reacting because I keep going over this one spot and every time it comes back up it's like bubbly again it was really cool I didn't think it would do that hi okay editor Janae here I don't know if this is in focus or not but I, I'm going to show you what I'm talking about because it, something real sciency is really going on here. And I just want to show you guys really up close because I keep talking about it throughout the video. So I just stirred it. And this is probably the side you're going to see the most on. Okay, so it's been quite a bit of time. Um, and now I'm going to poke this and hopefully you can hear it. Oh, like, it totally, like, pops all the bubbles. It makes sense because baking powder is used to raise up stuff. Like, 
rise stuff when you're like baking bread. Um, but I just didn't think it would work with paint. It's very weird, but it gives it the texture that it needs to make it actually look ceramic, so. Okay. We'll see how it looks when it dries. I'm sure it'll look a little bit different, but. That was really easy, actually, like. Well. I still have a whole bunch of this paint, so I'm just gonna paint the next thing with it. Um, I'll do this glass with it as well. Y'all, this is like the easiest freaking project to do. Oh my goodness. I love this. Ow. Amazing. That's so cute. Oh my goodness. Mm. I think for this one, I'm going to do a light gray. And the powder is actually working pretty good. It looks like how everyone else is looking. My other, my cup is looking a little weird, but I think it's because most of the baking soda got onto the base. All I can think about is that it looks like concrete. <laughs> oh my goodness, it looks like concrete. Loving this project. It's literally so freaking easy. Holy crap. <laughs> okay. I am the most excited about this one, and I know exactly the color I want to do it. This really nice green. Oh, it's such a pretty green. I'm so excited. I think I'm definitely gonna go back to Dollar Tree and grab more of these cute squared jars. Oh my goodness, so cute. For this one, I think I'm gonna try, mm, I don't know. <laughs> I kind of just want to paint it green because I love this green so much. Yeah, that's what I'm going to I'm just going to paint it green. So this is them wet and then I'll come back once they're dry and we'll see how it looks. But overall, easy project, really fun to do do it easily in 30 minutes. Okay. I'll see you in a couple hours. A few moments later. So everything is dry, but um, I'm thinking it needs a second coat just because some spots you can definitely tell it's lighter, especially on the red here. You can, I don't know if the camera's even going to be able to pick it up, but there's some spots that you can see through into the glass, so I'm just gonna speed through and just do another coat real fast.
Would this be a good thumbnail video? Or thumbnail? I don't know. Maybe like have it in your hand and you're like displaying it. I don't wanna hold I don't wanna grab it. I'm so scared. Anyways, I got a new camera. That's nice. It's like a good frame rate and everything too. Look how clear I look. I know. And I've been moving around and moving the camera and it's not doing stupid shit. I'm gonna film the outro of my next video with this. You're my shot. Can you lay down? Okay. Hi, the berry. Do you want me to find a shot? Come here. Okay. Barry, if you're gonna be sitting on me, you gotta look at the camera at least. This is all you wanted? Some love? Can you say hi to the camera? No. Okay, so this outro is being filmed with my new camera and mic that I just got. Very exciting. I can actually see myself now. And hopefully it's not gonna be out of focus all the freaking time. So basically this project turned out pretty good. This vase, however, I mean it looks fine as, lo as much as I could see on camera, but in person it's really bumpy and it's just, it didn't turn out as good which is good because it was just kind of my test. But everything else kind of turned out pretty good, actually. Wouldn't recommend doing gray, though, because it just looks like concrete. I mean, if that's what you're going for, but it to me, it just looks like concrete. But everything else, I think, turned out really cute. If you want to see more, you can head over to my Instagram. we will be posting a picture of these once I actually have plants in them. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to subscribe, and I will see you next week.